What up guys, welcome back to the video. Today, as you can see in the description, my wife is gonna be trying to catch a spoonbill catfish. So let's see if she can do it. So let's just get right onto it and see if she can hook this fish. We've been here for probably 15, 20 minutes or longer. Finally got the old thing stirred up. She's got the rod and stuff in her hand. The spoonbill's still in here. We just gotta find him again. It's really hard to see him today because the sun is not cooperating with us. The wind's blowing. So we can't really see hard down into the water. I seen him swim by and he's he's a real dark color, so he's really hard to see. But hopefully she'll snag his spoonbill and get him up out of the water here in a minute. I had my jig here. I was just jigging around trying to get him stirred up. So you can't catch them with a normal hook and whatnot. You gotta use, you, well, you use a normal hook, but it's more like snagging him than anything. But now we kind of got the water more dingy than it was. Me poking this stick around. But hopefully here in a minute the clouds apart and the sun will shine a little bit better and we'll be able to see him a little more. But right now what she's doing is just throwing out there, she's got a big swim bait hook because that's the biggest hook I got with a bullet weight on it. And she's using my, my Black Max with the Pro Max reel with braid. And all she's doing is just throwing out there and reeling in, seeing if she hooks something, see if she snags something. There's a lot of trash and debris in this area, so it's really hard to tell if you got a fish or if you got a, a tree like I'm holding here. If we can just get him close enough to see, we'll be set. I'm going to throw my jig around a little bit more. Got my hand dirty from the tree. See, it's really hard to judge because when you throw it in there, like your bait, your hook's probably sunk three foot now. So you gotta know like where he would be at, where the the string or the, the fishing line would get up over his back to where the hook hits him, and then you jam him. You just you just yank, you just give it full throttle, put the juice on it. You know what I mean? she's kind of new to a bait caster that's why she kind of looks like a i don't know what trying to throw it i don't know if you can even see her or not but the the spinning reel that i got this wouldn't be enough to try to get this fish in so that's why i got her on the bait caster hopefully we'll get a little more sun here in a minute <laughs> what do you look like doing that <laughs> well pitching Flipping and pitching is a little bit hard to do, so you're doing a pretty good job at it. I mean, I still suck at it too. I'm afraid to stand on this bank because it's falling through. Check that out. See, because the sun is not cooperating with us. You hook a stick, tree pounder. Well, if you hook his spoonbill, it'll be more in that tree pounder. Now jam it, jam it. Oh, you about had him. You about had him. You see him? He's still right over there. Hey, wait, he's going that way. You're really in. You're way too far. You're going to hit that stick. Let him come back over this way. See? Let it fall, let it fall, let it fall. Jam it. I can't. I can't. You're going to do it. What? what the heck? The line is all jammed up. You got to. <laughs> I 
I still got him. Oh! He hammered on it. I don't know where you went now. You're gonna have to do it, babe. <laughs> He'll swim back up here in a minute. Just sit here and hold and be on the ready and just kind of scan. He'll come back up in a minute. You see? <laughs> yeah. Light is fading fast, guys. It's really hard to see a foot down in the water now because the sun. Yeah, she's behind a cloud over there. We've seen it one or two more times, and that's about it. Yeah, that's, there's that cable thing there somewhere. It's not looking good. He's going that way. You're gonna get right in the trees there. You might get him there. Oh. No, nope. nope. see him right here? Now he's right here and you're hung. <laughs> Josh. I got you, didn't I? <laughs> yeah. Now I don't. Where'd you go, bud? Where did he go? Where did he go? Oh, I'm tying him up. Just keep watching him. Oh, I can't see him no more. Oh, I can't See him no more. I don't see him no more. Right here. <laughs> don't give it to me. No, you're right here. no, so you can do it better than me. I can't do it. Yeah, but you supposed to be the one catching it. I hook it, you reel it in, then I get down in there and get it. Yeah, I see. <laughs> Lucy dragged this. <laughs> no, 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 not under the tree. Not under the tree. He's in the branch. See ya! Here. <laughs> oh god, I can't! What if he gets off? Oh, he's off. Did he come off? Oh, man. No, he ain't. Oh, he's just quit fighting. <laughs> Here, let's not do it. Keep reeling. 
Come back up here. Walk back up here. He's sideways, so he's he's done fighting. Walk back up here. Walk back up here. Just drag him. He's gonna pull drag a little bit. Don't there here here here. Here, don't pull. If he starts pulling drag, stick your thumb up. Come over here. Right like that. He's coming back up his way. Now come up here. Walker, I gotta get down in this hole. He's He's barely side hooked. Stay out of the tree. Right here. Now see if you can see if you can back up a little bit. Slow, babe. Yeah, keep reeling in. Slow. 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 Look at that fish. Oh god. There's the spoonbill. Can you pick him up? No, I don't think I can. Grab his bill right here. I'm scared. I'm scared. Grab his bill. I can't. Oh, God. He ain't got teeth. Oh, God. Hold it tight. Ah, I can't Hold do it. Hold it tight. He's been hooked right here before. I can't. Oh, God. Grab his tail. Oh, God. Now, look at me. Turn him a little bit. He's a little sideways. He's a little sideways. Looks good. Woo, baby. Can you pick him up? He's too heavy. <laughs> He's too heavy. All right, guys, there you have it. The wife had caught, the wife reeled in the biggest fish of her life. She kind of caught it. I mean, I just hooked it. I could just say that was a, you know, accidental hook, hooking, and she reeled it in. She reeled it all the way to the bank, done an excellent job. But uh, there it is, guys. There you have it. The uh, wife catches, reels in, holds, takes pictures of, giggles, her biggest fish of her life. She did hook a fish one time at Lake Linville while we was out on a boat years ago. This thing pulled the front of the boat all the way around. The line snapped. I don't know what kind of fish that was. It could have been one of these paddlefish or spoonbills as we call them here. Could have been a big old catfish, big carp, who knows, but it was a pretty good sized fish. The wife, in a video, catching a mondo, spoonbill, catfish, whatever you call them. How'd you like that? Huh? Uh, she was really letting that Abu Garcia Pro Max eat, and that's for sure. Guys, thanks for watching this video. Hope you enjoy. Hope you like seeing my, my woman here on the videos. Uh, she, you can see she's still dressed in her, her scrub stuff. because She just got off of work and comes straight here to meet me here to do this video. So, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy. If you're new here, drop down and hit the subscribe button. Hit the thumbs up for my wife. We love each and every one of you. We'll see you on the next video. That did not sound right. <laughs>